What's going on YouTube? How's it going? It's Friday and as promised in my last few videos, today is the day we do the pin collections of Pokemon Go. I have a whole case here. It's not literally a whole case. I bought them individually at my local Target. If you guys don't know, I do work at for a Target, so I do get a, a little discount, which makes it a lot easier for me to buy these. A lot cheaper than getting them on TCG Player. We got ourselves a nice bubble sore. We got ourselves Squirtle. Hello Squirtle, what's up with your present? Beautiful, beautiful pen as we'll go through that. And we got ourselves a uh, Charmander. What's up, Charmander? We got two of each, which is what a case is. Six packs, you know, no big deal. Pin collections. But anyways, we're not going to go any further with that. We're going to just keep on going. We'll we get this video started. Not too long of a video, hopefully, today. You know, it's just a couple of uh, just 18 packs. So just That's all it is. Just 18 packs. Nice, comfortable, old, nice, comfortable Friday video. Hope you guys enjoy it. I, I know I will hopefully enjoy it, too. We all know these... Uh, Extra, uh, I, I would say that the, uh, ever since they printed off the new ones, you only get three packs per pin, for ten, per uh, box, if you guys are curious about that. We have a nice little Bulbasaur pin, very, very nice. Love, who doesn't love a Bulbasaur pin? And who doesn't love a nice, beautiful code card for the beautiful Bulbasaur? All right, look at that Bulbasaur. Very, very cute. Very, very nice. All right, let's get going. Let's stop playing around. You know what, though? I forgot. I kind of forgot to do this because, you know, I also want to do this, too. You also get the codes for the Pokemon Go t game. We are going to go with Bulbasaur's first. Bulbasaur is cool. We're going to go with the Bulbasaur first. It was number one in the Pokedex, actually, for Kanto vibes. I do like how it has Kanto vibes for these... Uh, Pokemon Go, here we go. All right, if you guys like this content, you know you should like and subscribe. You know I'm not going to try and... Uh, um, go too too fast in these, but also not try and go too slow in these. We need to get some more cards. I'm still missing a lot of the golds and rainbows. Basically, still missing a couple of reverse hollows out of the set. If you guys have noticed, though, most of the set you will get the same cards for the most part. It's a pretty small set. We got ourselves a Wimpod, and ooh, and you're always a winner in this set too. You always get a hollow rare, so you never know what you're gonna get in this set. When it comes to a pack, all the code cards are have the same color on the back, so you can't tell that way either. You know, Pokemon Go, uh, this is about it for Pokemon Go openings. I do believe we have the Dragonite um, collection. I don't think there's any more Pokemon Go stuff that I can name off the top of my head that's going to come out. So this is almost our last one. Almost the last Pokemon Go set. Um, if we don't get it within Dragonite, we'll probably do... Look at that reverse Charmander. Very, very nice. And let's see. On the Red Valor Gym. I'm not... That's not... Uh, no. 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 We don't do Blissies on Valor Gyms. Okay, Blissey. You belong on the Mystic Gym. Okay. As you know, I'm Team Mystic. Uh, I do... The uh, reason why my channel is Juggernaut 13 is that's what my name is for Pokemon Go, honestly. Here's the last of the first Bulbasaur box. Um, what do you guys think about these? These things are not exactly the most cheapest things in the world. Sorry, Pikachu. We got Glasspot and Gyarados. And that box was empty. Very, very empty. Makes me feel like that's basically how it's going to... That's how it's been. We get the next Bulbasaur box. Okay, here we go give you the same stuff i'm not gonna show you the, the cards as much anymore but you know we got ourselves the codes for the pokemon go game um don't know what's even in those I've, I've never did the codes i have an apple which makes it slightly annoying to use i don't know if you guys can see that code but there's that code for you guys all right we got ourselves a three packs and we're off we're still missing that gold well uh, Missing the gold Mewtwo, missing the rainbow Mewtwo, missing the gold Dragonite. Is there a gold Dragonite? I don't think so. Never mind. There is a rainbow Dragonite, though. Missing the rainbow. Missing the trainers that are rainbows, except for the Professor's Willow. Missing all the gold cards, actually. What is it? The lure module, the egg incubator. What's up, Pokestop? Uh, missing the Pokestop reverse. I know that. Missing Unpheasant. And we got ourselves Bulbasaur and Pikachu. All right, Pikachu. Um... I was kind of, I've kind of realized this as this set has gone along and the kept will come out more products. The hit rates on these are way worse than what they were at the start. I feel like they do that with a lot of the uh, um, subsets. The hit rates are always really good at first. I remember hitting fates, you know, the pin collections and hit fates were absolutely fire when they first came out. And they just weren't the same after that. Kind of feels like with that with with all kind of subsets, that they, they, they make the hit rates really, really good at first. We got a Melmetal and, ooh, we got ourselves a Mewtwo. What's up? We got ourselves our first Ultra Rare. We got Ultra Rare Mewtwo V. Very, very nice. Not worth a ton. Maybe like a dollar, dollar fifty, maybe on a good day. But it's nonetheless still our first Ultra Rare, and we love Mewtwo. Who doesn't love Mewtwo? I'm a Mew fan, so we got Mewtwo. We got our, we got his. I don't know what he calls brother. I don't know his alternate clone. If you guys don't know the origin of Mewtwo, <laughs> Mewtwo was made in a laboratory based on Mew. 
interesting there. We need a little bit of origin on me too. Here's the last pack of the Bulbasaurus. Weird. I kind of kind of forget how um, fast these things kind of go through. There's only three packs a piece. I'm like, oh man, we're already done with them. But and nonetheless, we got ourselves a pump. We got Spinneret, not a Ditto, and Sylveon. What's up? What's up, Sylveon? Nice little evolution there. All right, that was Bulbasaur. Very, very um, underwhelming Bulbasaur, but I have a feeling Squirtle's gonna do something for us. Right, Squirtle, aren't you? Yeah, let's go. Let's go, Squirtle. If you guys haven't checked out my last video, definitely should, you know, do the pack, do the box, do the box battle with Energizer. It was fun, you know, um, we lacked a little energy, or kind of tired or whatnot like that, but we always have a good time hanging out with each other. If you didn't, go check out his video. He'd appreciate it. There's the, uh, number for you i'm not gonna pull them all out i just don't really want to but there's a nice cute pin and the card i kind of want to just kind of run through this real quick here you know i put my goat as a set that was eh, i would say kind of fun at first uh it was fun when all the hits were coming out now it just feels like i get the same ones over and over again it's like come on i don't think i even pulled a radiant charizard um on the channel yet which would be nice to pull still like i said i'm still missing all the all the secrets it's really weird how i'm missing secrets a palm and taranta what's up my boy if you guys know tarantar is definitely one of my top favorites maybe top 10 maybe top five i don't know dragonite's top five i have mew amphros those two are up there dragonite one of my favorites yeah those are basically top three for sure i mean i know i know i come around and talk about other pokemon but man for for life of me, I honestly cannot remember. Oh, Lugia is definitely one of my top five of all time. I've always loved Lugia. We got Blanche and we have Moltres. I need the reverse Moltres. Where is that reverse Moltres? Do not need the reverse trainers, okay? Not those ones anyway. Just need a Pokestop. All right, let's go. Last pack of these. This uh, three pack of pen. Um, what do these retail for? I think they retail for fourteen ninety nine. Not hundred percent sure on that. I would just kind of. I want to say four, maybe it's fifteen ninety nine. Kind of expensive, honestly. And I think they do it because of the promo and the pin. Um, because the pack-wise, is hey, we got ourselves a Gyarados. And, ooh, Kinkeldor. At least we got an Ultra Rare. Kinkeldor, uh, not an exciting Ultra Rare, that's for sure. Kinkeldor may be worth maybe 75 cents. You know, nothing too crazy, but it's an Ultra Rare nonetheless. We got ourselves an Ultra Rare out of that box. I will guess I'll take that. We'll see if we can get something really nice, though. The Rainbow Mewtwo is still going for, like, $40.00. Absolutely insane. The gold one's going for like, uh, I think 30. Here's those codes for you. I'm going to pop these bad boys out here. I know like a lot of stuff going behind the camera. That's why we need this little, we need a little face camera going on here. What's going on? What's going on, Pax? Those packs are really crispy, by the way. And we got ourselves a nice code for those promo, for that promo of Squirrel. We get that plastic out of here. Ew. I do recycle all my plastic and cardboard, you know, gotta, gotta protect the environment somehow, you know. So, I do that, you know, gotta, gotta be a little environmental, you know, aware. Plastic, not good for our environment. Non-biodegradable, I believe, I don't know, something like that. Anyways, we're on the Pokemon, we don't, we don't care about that, what's going on, guys? Alright, we got some cells, Terminator, we got Apom, next video will be a Blissey and uh, Sylveon. Alright, my next video... Uh, Wednesday, we're doing a sleep pack booster back. You guys had a really good time of watching that sleep pack of a uh, booster box of uh, of Astro Radiance. Um, I do that with every single video, with every single new set, not every single video, but every single new set I do that video. So that will be next uh, Wednesday for sure, hundred percent. Come and check that out. You know, come. You know, we you should always check out all my a nice reverse blast toys. I'll take those. Not worth a ton, but I bet I can sell, I can still sell for like 50 cents, honestly. And, ooh, another Mewtwo. Okay. And this feels um, awfully familiar compared to, you know, just like the Pokeballs, I believe. Where I got multiples of the exact same Ultra Rare. Got another Mewtwo, though. Another $1.25 in the, in the books. Not the V-Star, though. Come on. Where's the V-Stars at? That's what we want. We want the big hitters. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Ah. That one did not have a code in it. Oddly enough, no code in that box. That was weird. And look at look at the print quality on those. Very, very shiny. I'm not a huge fan of shiny print quality like that. Always obsessed me when I see print quality that bad. I know it's part of like um, some sort of cardboard they do or something like that, but it just still obsessed me. We got normal, non-ditto, and Lapras. Okay. All right. Well, at least that box... Wait, that box only had one ultra rare too. Is it uh, one of those like one ultra rare per uh, box things? Anyways, we're on to the bad boy himself, Mr. Charmander. 
What you got for us? You got at least Charizard in here? I hope so. Because, uh, honestly, a little underwhelming. That's okay. I wasn't expecting too much. On, like I said, I'm not, I wasn't expecting too much out of these, uh, boxes. Because Pokemon, this is like, it's like fourth or fifth product release. So, I don't know. Well, you got the ETBs, the EV boxes, those collection boxes with the Executor. You know, uh, man. You had the pen collections of these. We had the, uh... The Pokeballs, we had, um, oh, the Mini Tins, I've already done one. So, yeah, um, this is like the fifth or sixth item of collections for the set. So, uh, I don't expect much, like I said, uh, I do feel like the farther you go along in, um, for subsets, the harder the pull rates are. We kind of seen that with, um, Shiny Fates a little bit. How, if you saw a couple of my, my very first Shiny Fates videos, back when I very first started YouTube, um, the pull rates were absolutely insane compared to what they are now. Wimpod and Snorlax. At least there's a new holo rare. Showcasing all the holo rares in this set. That's for sure. Still not getting those, uh, reverse hollows we need, unfortunately. But, uh, we're having fun. We're, you know, we're, we're enjoying our time, right? It's just Pokemon. We're enjoying Pokemon. Come on now. Who doesn't enjoy some po nice Pokemon? Nice quick Pokemon opening. I enjoy a nice quick Pokemon opening. And, it, you know, it helps out. Helps out the channel in some ways, you know, the little quick vi videos. Oh, we got it on Feathers. I know it's not exciting to you guys, but that is a reverse holo we were missing. Out of the box. Out of the box. And, uh, and Charizard. All right. I'll take a Charizard. Got some scratches on it, though, unfortunately. But I'll still take Charizard. Very, very nice. And we got the Unpheasant. Part of the reverse hollows. That's one more reverse holo down. Two more to go. Need the Moltres. Need the Pokestop. Can we get those? That'd be awesome. Get out of here, pack. Just... Sorry, that pack was sticking to me. It was obliterated. It just wanted to fall apart. Maybe that means there's something good in here. This is the last pack of this Charmander box. Come on, Charmander. Don't let us down. I'm, I'm counting on you. I am serious counting on you. Don't let the others make you look bad. All right? We got Raticate. We got Squirtle and Pikachu. Well, that Charmander box let us down. I hate to break it to you guys. It did. It let us down. We got one more Charmander box to go, and that's it. The last one. This is the only one I did not purchase at Target. I could tell because it, it has a price tag on it. This was purchased at my local card shop. Um, the only one, the only one I didn't purchase at Target. So yeah, I get as Target, I get fifteen percent discount on everything in the store, basically. So buying this stuff is actually more convenient for me to buy it online, buy it on at Target than buy it online because first of all, they don't sell cases of this on TCG Player, which is where I usually buy all my stuff at. Not a huge fan of eBay too much. I'll buy some stuff. But not a huge fan. There's the code for the Charmander. I'll give you a nice little pen for Charmander. Very, 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 very cute. Very, very cute. All right. And we're off. Stop playing around with that Charmander. All right. Three packs to go. Wish me some luck. Hit that like, subscribe. You know, just give me some good luck for these last three packs. We need it. We needed some hits. We need to show that the, these pen collections are kind of are worth buying. What do you guys think? Do you think these are worth buying? I mean, based on these pull rates. But, um, yeah, I, you know, I, I'll do these openings no matter what, and I'm going to post them no matter what the pull rate, pulls are, because I want you guys to see what the pull rates are for some of these items that, that, that Pokemon come out with. And, ooh, another good Keldor. Okay. All right. Now, stop playing. And this good Keldor is bent, by the way. Has a nice crease, like, right down the middle. Awesome. All right. Anyway, we got another good Keldor. We have a little bit of a uh, pattern going on here. Interesting. Interestingly enough. Uh, yeah. <laughs> you should like and subscribe just for the pain that I'm suffering for right now. I mean, this cost me like what, like seventy dollars for these all together, and uh, that's all I got. I we got hmm, maybe five dollars worth, if that. Not even that, probably. We need to get something crazy. I think I see something shiny back here. I think we got something back here. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. We got. We got a. We got a. Yeah, we got a ditto. We have a ditto, everybody. And oh, full art can Keldor. There we go. We got a hit. This is the alternate art of Keldor, by the way, not the full art, an actual alternate art. We finally got a hit. I do not know the actual price on this, but I believe it's not worth a lot, maybe five bucks or so. But I don't care. We got a hit. We finally got a hit, and we got the ditto. And uh, I'm I'm sorry, ladies but, and gentlemen, but I'm not going to you know, take this ditto off. I've already showcased the dittos before on this channel. You should go check out my, a couple of my other Pokemon on Go videos. But I wanted this for my binder because I don't have any of the hollow rares in my binder. But there you go. It's a ditto for sure. All right. Last pack magic. We got that though. That's, that's, that's something. That is something. That is definitely something. I will take that no matter what. But we need some gold or rainbow action. That's all we need. A gold or a rainbow, please. 
last pack hit that like hit that subscribe come on now we're almost at 100 we're so close we are so close to 100 come on give me those three more subscribers that's all i need just three more and i'm at 100 which is crazy because uh it, like two months ago i was at 50 so we're growing we're absolutely growing so fast i mean i can't say so fast but we're definitely growing these last couple months keep it going everybody please we got ourselves tarantar it's our reverse hollow and uh lapras you ruined it you ruined it man oh well charmander took, came in clutch we got the we got the alternate arc in keldor v very very nice love it love it i wish i would have gotten a rainbow that would have been nice but uh there you go. That's what you get when you or when you get these pin collections. You just get Mewtwo's and King Keldors. I'm just playing with you. I mean, that's what we got today. But uh, yeah, we opened six of them. 18 packs. That's what we got. Not nothing too crazy, but not too bad either. I'll, I'll take the King Keldor all day long. It's a very very nice, pretty card. Have not pulled it on the channel. I do own it, but I haven't pulled it on the channel. So I'll take that all day long. Thank you guys so much. You know, um, go check out my other videos. If you want to go see more Pokemon Go videos, there are definitely more in there. I do have a playlist of those, so you can go check those out. Also, you know, don't forget to come back on Wednesday for my uh, booster packs of sleeves of Lost Origin, where we're going to try and hunt for some Giratinas. That's what we want. Giratina Alternate Art. We're going for it, all right? Thank you guys so much. I appreciate all the love and support. Come back on Wednesday. Like and subscribe. And thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys Wednesday.